Welcome back to the TRT and Hormone Optimization YouTube channel. Today we have, as a guest, back here, Gil T. Welcome, Gil. Thank you, Steve. And nice to see you uh, matching uh, Tank Top Saturdays. Sure thing. So, a quick question. Will TRT make me smarter, more intelligent? This is the TRT and Hormone Optimization YouTube channel. And if you want to learn all about the science-based information on this topic, consider subscribing Hit that notification bell and you'll be on your way. Well, that would be a great selling point, wouldn't it? Um, okay, so directly the answer is no. Uh, intelligence is, uh, I, I like to think of as a two-step process or a two-tier process. Uh, and this is really more subjective and it's up to debate. Everyone's got their own definition of intelligence. Intelligence is a combination of being able to compute and interpret information and it is also a second tier of acquiring, retaining, and retrieving information. So one can argue that as life goes on, barring any mishaps or brain injuries that cause us to regress, our intelligence continually grows because as we retain more information, harvest that information, interpret it, and come to uh, life experiences, we then become more intelligent. Uh, at the same time, our ability to compute over time uh, initially, it kind of looks like a bell curve from youth, right? And then all of a sudden, the experience and development of the brain becomes, uh, you know, uh, at a peak. And then all of a sudden, it starts to regress with aging, um, you know, dementia, delirium, Alzheimer's, etc. However, putting aside all of the factors of environmental age and genetics, if you are where you are today, and you are deficient, which is the key word here, because TRT in and of itself does not increase anything per se at uh, physiological doses. But what it will do is if you are deficient, neurotransmitters, uh, neurosteroids, and other brain activity uh, hormones and chemicals may be inhibited. The ability of neurons to fire, the ability of uh, cell regeneration and whatnot may be inhibited by a deficiency somewhere in your endocrine system. By repairing this deficiency with proper therapy, you may be giving yourself the optimal environment that is conducive to maximize intelligence and the ability to memorize and compute and interpret information. So it's not necessarily going to take a healthy, intelligent person and make them more intelligent. It is going to lift the foot off the chest, so to speak, of someone who is being inhibited from maximizing their potential. Now we do know that there are other advantages to TRT, such as improving fatigue, motivation, uh, mental cognition and whatnot. So these factors are gonna give you the best fighting chance at improving your intelligence level via environmental factors like studying and working and learning and going out there and actually making yourself more productive. And that will, over the course of time, lead, of course, to uh, elevated level of intelligence. So when you are deficient and you're kind of not in the mood to go out and get anything done by optimizing your hormone levels back to where they should be, you're now going to go out there and do more research and work harder and work on self-actualization, which is the process of improving yourself. So in a sense, directly, very slight chance that is going to allow you the capability of becoming more intelligent just by repairing that biochemistry deficiency. But then secondary to that, you have that indirect effect by giving you the motivation to actually go out there and do the work. So um, if I had to say, does it help you become more intelligent? The short answer is yes, but I say that with a grain of salt because I don't want people to just think they're going to take a medication and become smart. You have to put in the work and effort. It's just going to bring you back to a state of normalcy or optimal uh, environment to actually get go out there and get what it is that you're seeking. Mm -hmm. Makes sense, thank you. And now do this next, click on one of these thumbnails to learn a ton more about TRT and hormone optimization.